Today I interviewed Chunky Monkey VR. You may know him from the No More Rainbows tournament or his channels up there. I just want to give a huge thanks for him coming out and letting me interview him. So without a further ado, let's get on to the interview. All right. So, first question: uh, What made you want to start YouTube? Um, I got inspired by this one YouTuber named Milkshake GT, and also K9. So I kind of started it because like I saw how much they were growing and stuff. So then I wanted to become like them. So then I kind of just started YouTube like that. Hmm. All right. Uh, what's your favorite VR game besides Gorilla Tag? Or um, definitely No More Rainbows. All right. Yeah. Congratulations on your uh, win, by the way, on the first tournament. Oh yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. So how does it? feel to like how'd it feel to win that tournament the what are the no more rainbows i mean yeah. i didn't win but i got pretty much like i got third and then second but it felt kind of good but at the same time i was a little sad because i really wanted to get first but i mean still third out of like 32 other creators and like me beating k9 and all that that was pretty cool all right so how long have you been playing Gorilla Tag? Um, I've been playing since, uh, like when Caves first came out. It was like super OG. Like, oh, a dude, thousand that's players. a while. Yeah. It was very that long. Was, that was like early game. Yeah, not many people know about it on my channel, only because I started like recent Christmas. So, pretty much like a year ago, I started. But I could have started when I first started playing, but I didn't, which kind of makes me sad. So I could have been insanely popular, like 100k or something, but yeah. Yeah. Is there any meaning behind your outfit? Uh, I kind of just chose it because it looks cool. Like, I never wore a Russian hat or anything like that, but I kind of just chose it because, like, uh, I had that fat suit and I wanted it to match my um like something with my outfit so i just chose the um i mean the russian hat and then i chose the turkey leg which is like my most important one because this was like the first cosmetic that i like it was i bought this actually like og and it was like my first cosmetic i ever bought that was like um one of like the sprint i mean no, one of the like exclusive ones and I bought it so OG, and then everyone would always just look at it and be like, no way, you actually have the uh, turkey leg. And I'm like, yep. And that's why. Uh, is the turkey leg your favorite cosmetic? Um, not really. I think, hold up, maybe either this or, um, eh, I don't know, probably this, in my opinion. I don't know. If I maybe thought more about it, it would probably be something else, but just like to the spot, probably just like this one. I really like turkey leg. Mm. It looks cool. Alright, so Avoid actually wanted to ask you a question. Do uh, you remember oh, what it was? Shoot, uh, wait. Oh, like, what are some tips to grow on YouTube? Um, one tip is always be motivated. Because if you're not motivated and you're posting videos, your videos will kind of not be as good and stuff. Like, whenever I'm not motivated and I'm just posting a video, it's not well edited or anything. But if you get motivated, like, what you to get motivated is just, like, maybe watching other YouTubers, just, like, scrolling through, like, they like your favorite YouTuber and just watching his videos and stuff. Doing something like that. And that's probably, like, the best tip. All right. What's motivation. your, um, dream to hit in subscribers? My dream? Um, uh, my dream is 100k. Only because I really, really, really want a plaque. Like, having a plaque would be insane. And being able to comment on people's videos, and it's just like a check. That would oh, be yeah. super sick. A little verified thing. Yeah, that would be sick. Right. So, how <laughs> long did it take you to get good at No More Rainbows? Um, when I first started playing, I kind of was already, like, I was a little bit good already, because I'm, like, really good at, I would say I'm really good at Gorilla Tag, but, like, um, for No More Rainbows, 
I kind of just like non-stop just played uh first off story mode and I try to at least get like top like a hundred on like everything I played like all the races so that got me like very good at like moving around and then when deathmatch came out I just started straight up like one day I played it for like almost like five hours or something just deathmatch and non-stop just like playing a match and a match and getting a win like every single second I was like ranked like top like 10 like worldwide and then I stopped playing for like three weeks and then I'm ranked like 90 which kind of sucks but oh. alright yeah, that's how I got good yeah so why did you choose the name chunky monkey um so i'm not actually like chunky in real life i'm actually like i'm pretty fit i guess i don't know i'm kind of skinny but like um the reason why is because like me and my friend it's a funny story me and my friend were like in a lobby together and then he's like you need a name because like my name was just the gorilla number 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 because i didn't really like care that much about this game and then we were like, he was like, why don't you just name it like, well, like, no, 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 it can't, it went like, because we were like joking around like Nick Avocado and stuff, and then I was like, why don't I name it Chunky Monkey, because like Nick Avocado was like, oh, yeah. you know, Wait. that's like literally why I did it, it's crazy. And I just made it my YouTube name, because I didn't really know what else to do. So what was like the point where you like knew you were going somewhere, and you had the most uh, the motivation to make videos? Probably so. Mm, the most motivation was for sure uh, the summer and yeah. stuff. Cause in the summer, like legit, I would try to post a video every day and stuff. Or actually, no. Mm, wait, hold on. Let me think. Maybe I don't know when I had the most motivation. I know I've had like at some times I've had insane amount of motivation. Like yes. summer, I've had a lot of motivation. Um. Mm. Throughout the beginning of last year's school year, like, I had a lot of motivation. Like, right after, like, the Christmas update, the next update, yeah, I had a lot of motivation there. I don't know. I right. just had a lot of motivation all around. Yeah. But so, yeah. what wanted you you to, like, start making like, update videos? Uh, update yeah. videos? Yeah. Pretty much, I just, like, um... So, the one, the time that I actually, like, started, like, really doing them is when, like, the school update, and I just kind of was, like, all right, I'm just going to, like, think of an idea that I might, that might come to Gorilla Attack, and I thought, oh, a school update, maybe, because, like, school is coming, and I looked oh, it up on right. YouTube, yeah, I looked it up on YouTube, no one's ever done it before, so I'm, like, I'm going to just do this, I'm about to just, like, see if it actually happens, and it did. And that's the point where I was like, oh, I'm actually going to start doing it a lot. But, like, when I actually, like, wanted to do it in the beginning was when I saw, um, I don't know, I don't remember his name, but, like, it was, like, a prediction update. It was, like, one of the prediction, like, cosmetic updates and stuff. So I was just like, why don't I, instead of just cosmetics for, like, a prediction, I do, like, maps, maybe, like, new, like, mechanics or just random stuff like that. I think I know who you're talking about. Is it Cub Cub? Yeah, yeah, it's Cub Cub. It's Cub Cub. That is it. Yeah. Yeah, I watch Cub, them too. I, I like them. watching all the update videos, so that's why you're one of my yeah. favorites. Mm. Alright. So, do you have a favorite Gorilla Tag map, and what is it? Uh, my favorite Gorilla Tag map is Forest, only because this is where I started playing a lot, and this is where I'm, like, insanely good at. Like, I can do, like, pretty much, like, I can, like, scale, Lucio, wall run. Uh, I can just do everything. Do ground, everything. I'm really good at moving around the gazebo. Like, I can do, like, this move really well. Like, just, like, going around it quickly. Nice. Like, whenever I'm, like, playing against people. Yeah, that's what I, that's my favorite map. Mm. All right. And they update this map the most, too, so, like, I like it. What's your favorite update in Gorilla Tag? Oh, my favorite update is... Um, probably this year's Christmas, this year's Christmas update, like, that was such a fun update, with, like, the brooms, all these uh, ghosts and stuff, because I also, like, hadn't played Gorilla Tag in such a long time, and when it came out, I was like, oh, shoot, this is insane, and it was just super fun, like, seeing all the new stuff you could do, because that was, like, one of the years that I played with, like, my friends a lot, and so I was just, like, 
having a fun time. I didn't really like post that much then. I was just like playing in it because it was fun. It was very fun. Yeah. What's your favorite YouTube video you've made? Oh, my favorite YouTube video I've made? Probably, um. That'd be. I made this one where it was pretty much like me like trying to predict the update. But actually, no, not that one. It had to be like my first. My first No More Rainbows video was my favorite, in my opinion, actually. It's the one that's on, like, when you click on my channel, it's, like, the first thing. That's definitely my favorite, actually. Mm. And then my second to the nerd one. I really like the nerd. Uh, has the rarest badge one. Yeah. Like that one. If you could meet anyone in Gorilla Tag, who would it be? If I could meet anyone, it would probably be, um... Uh... I already met K9, like, a little bit ago. That was in... Oh, yeah. Uh, Gorilla Tag, but still, I've already met him. I would actually like to meet, uh, not J-Man, but BMT. Nice. Like, I really want to meet BMT. Well, I think that, um, wraps up the interview, Chunky. Thanks for coming out. Alright. No problem. Yeah. Problem, no problem. <laughs> Alright.